Do you reckon now that women has got more job opportunities than men? No, I do not. Because, you know, you've got all the lap dancers, all the, the bitch, the woman in the rap videos, whatever, strippers, you know. But let me tell you, honestly, how would you feel if you had to sell sex? Your sex? What if people pay me money for sex? No, honestly. I mean, I know, like, okay. I always be there yeah, every you day. So cool. I always yeah, do right. be in the office yeah, 24 yeah, right, hours right, right, a day, right, yeah. seven days a week, three, six, nine. Right, how about telling me you like different things, okay? Can Wicked, I like. We can use me this. like Punani. Hello. Me like <laughs> We're going to use this Dewey again, okay? To say I like. Chicken. So hang on. Dewey. Dewey Hoffy. You say Hoffy? What is that? I like. Hoffy? Hoffy to like. Like coffee? Yeah? So you can say Dween Hoffy. I don't like coffee. Oh, well, never mind. <laughs> Tell me something you do like, yeah? So, chicken. Dween... We like the chicken. So put that in front of it. Dween Hoffy. Dui chicken. Dween Hoffy. No. <laughs> chicken. I don't like coffee. You no, know, Hoffy means to like. Yeah? Dween Hoffy. Dween Hoffy chicken. No, I don't like coffee. This is coffee. <laughs> now you is a homophobic doctor. What's that like? Homeopathic. All right. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Yo, yo, yo. Yeah. No, seriously, keep your own prejudices at home because, you know, there might be gay lords out there who's watching this now. I don't want you to insult them. So... No, no. you use the word hom Ta homophobic. You should take that back, that word that you said. I didn't use the word you did. I used the word homeopathic which is a system for deciding when people are sick, what medicinal substance will most help that individual. I think it's wrong to say that them people are sick. They've got a different way of living than us. You have misunderstood, sir. I don't want to be the guy who's in charge of this whole thing saying that kind of language is okay. Sorry. Let's talk about doctors. Does they have the right to end old people's lives. That's euthanasia. Why is it the responsibility of the euthanasia for killing someone else? Surely it's between that patient and the doctor. No, euthanasia is the term that's used when you are killing. It's a nice word for killing. Well, whatever. You were saying that it's mainly Asian youths that no, is... No, 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 no. Does you think that they're responsible for this? You don't also agree with him. Who's responsible for it? No. The euthanasia. We is going to be talking about the drug thing. Let's start from over here. I mean, that's Moroccan black, isn't it? Yeah. After the end, obviously, if you didn't know that. So what is the names for it? I mean, we all know it's called the bionic, the bomb, the puff, yeah. the black, the herb, the sensi, the chronic. Yeah. The Sweet Mary Jane, the shit, the bomb, the ganja, the reefer, the bad, the Buddha, the ungrown, the ill, the Maui Maui, the method, the pot, the shake, the stunt, the stress, the tie, the wacky. But is there any other terms that parents should be aware of? Puff, blow, lots of, lots of names. And what is its effects? Uh, you can go paranoid. Um, it makes your heart race. Uh, your blood pressure can go low, so you can feel a bit woozy sometimes. It's got a, a lot of medical effects on the body. And is there any negative effects? <laughs> no, those are negative effects. Well, uh, so if you wanted to get started, would you recommend this as a good first smoke? I wouldn't recommend it, no. No, but if you has got it in your own, then that is cool, isn't it? No. It's, it's, it's all illegal. It's all against the law. But if you was using it for personal use or whatever, you was... It is legal if you has got, like, half a kilo or something like that. <laughs> I wouldn't like to try that on. Which drugs is Class A? Class A drugs are the... Well, mainly the, the heroin and cocaine type of drugs. Does Class A absolutely guarantee that there is better quality? <laughs> no, nothing to do with quality. Ain't the most worrying thing about these, though, that it actually make you enjoy house music? Yeah, you enjoy music, yeah. Is there a chemical inside it that actually make you dance like a bellend? Yeah, you, it makes you dance. What is it, that chemical called? Well, it's, it is, it's, it's the ecstasy, it's the actual chemical itself. What is the lesson 
the real lesson that people out there need to know. Substances, chemicals, drugs, affect the way your body works. For real. Your body is beautifully constructed. Thank you. It works very, very well. If you take any of these things, you run a big risk of making it work not so well. A planet is, well, we live on a planet. Earth is a planet. It's round. It's, uh, it's pretty large, but it's small compared to a star. Like, the sun is a star. Uh, and you could take a million Earths. A million Earths could fit inside the sun. That's how big it is. What, the sun is bigger than the Earth? Oh, yes, much bigger. Star. But it's just so but it's far about... away. Well, of course, it's so far away. Do you think man will ever walk on the sun? No. The sun is too hot. It is not a good place to go to. What happens if they went in winter when the sun is cold? The sun is not cold in the winter. But let's just sort it out. What do you say to all those conspiracy theorists who come up to you and say, does the moon really exist? I don't think there are very many people who question whether the moon exists. It what? exists. And all right, you just heard it here. It does exist. So all those people out there who are saying it don't, you was wrong. That's right. Okay, well, what's going to happen here today is you're going to actually participate in some Philadelphia Police recruit training. Wicked, man. Okay, well, we're going to do some scenarios in which the officers will actually respond to some incidents. We can't just go up and start shooting. Okay? For real. So. That's him. Okay. Tell him, tell him to stop. Yo, stop it. Sta keep your distance. Keep your distance. No, stop him, motherfucker. Okay, tell him to put his hands up. Yo. Yo, motherfucker. Put up your hands, or is you going to be shot by us? Okay, tell him you see the gun. I can see the motherfucking gun. Put that up. You can't curse. You can't curse. You can't curse. Okay, walk around him. Yo. Put your right hand up, sir. Now put Where do we see? Away. Put your, gun, put your away. gun away. Put your gun away. Okay, no, don't point it at him. Don't point it's it a at fake him. gun. He's got a fake gun. Okay, that's fine. He's got a fake gun. That's you fine. Do the job. All right. Do the okay, job. try to do this Wait, to the fake gun. He might gun. have another one. Might, hold on. He might have another gun. You okay. thought that was funny doing Roll this over, fake sir. gun on this. You picked the wrong cop to fuck around with, Slambo. Okay, well, we don't talk like that in Philadelphia. When I was 14, I fingered this girl called Ruth Jonas. And she found out that me was letting people sniff me fingers for 10 pence. And she told me that I was history. Is I history? Well, you were history for her. Ain't a lot of movies about slavery basically racialist? Like, whenever them needs to cast a slave, them always choose a brother. Well, there were no white slaves. What? In America, in the United States. So couldn't it be argued that slavery is a bit racialist? Well, it was totally racist. And that's, you know, who that guy is. Who's that? That guy is the father of the American Navy, John Paul Jones. Was it difficult for him to live and fight without having any arms or legs? Well, no, he actually had a full body. That artist didn't want to do the full body. He All just right. stopped right here. We're, we're homo sapiens, and that's about well, yo, eight steps down. I just want to make clear, because this is going out on the TV or whatever, that yeah. I, I don't do that stuff. I ain't got nothing against it. Oh, it's the homo that threw him off. I mean, yeah, explain yeah. that. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, it, it is a scientific nomenclature that describes who we are as part of a phyla or a stream of, right. you know, it goes hominid, hominoid, and then... Yeah, whatever, through. there's different names for it. We're all homo, homo sapiens. All humans would be considered... My wife is a homo sapien. sapien. But that's not homosexual. We're all homo that's sapiens. Totally that's right. Yeah. yeah, well, it's just a way of describing who we are. Would I say, you know, I, I just want to make clear yeah. your respect for coming on, and I ain't going to treat you differently now that that has come out. You know, that's safe. No, it has nothing to no, 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 come no, out. No, no, no. Yeah, come on now, you're confused here. Let's settle the confusion. Mm -hmm. All of people in the whole world, the biologists have, in a group called Homo, and the particular human group below that is Sapiens. And all that is Greek. It just means the Greek word for man smart. Yeah, a lot of them is very talented. It has nothing to do with homosexuals. It has nothing to do with the homos that you meet on the street. Right. It's an entirely different lingo. But my point is... So is, no, is we, you uh, one of the homo lot? I am a homo sapien. I think all humans are homo sapiens. Yo, you are so too. Just, okay. You are yo, too. Yo, yo. 
the term homo and homo sapien right. has nothing at all to do with sex. All right. So would you flush? Oh, sure. And I think you should have a septic system that's uh, properly designed to handle the waste. You say that, but there's evidence backstage to the contrary. Was it, was it you? I have no idea what you're talking about. No, I was talking about. No, I have no clue. The floater. Covering it with paper don't make it all right, you know? That goes for the rest of you, whoever it was. Right? I ain't pointing any fingers, but I does have my suspicions. Well, I don't, it was, it was not me, if that's what you're saying. I would not, I, if I understand what you're even talking about, which yeah. I don't part of the time here. You know what I was talking about, because if it was, then shame on you. I still, you're very confusing. Yo, I ain't pointing fingers, yo, but is you the one backstage that didn't flush? No, sir. You know what I was talking about, because the... If that's what you're talking about, about. You know, why you talk about that on a TV program blows my mind. Just saying, out of respect, and we're all talking about respect and whatever. Whoever it was, and I ain't just, you know, I don't care. Let's just... Well, then go on to something else. Let's put it to the side. But that ain't right. Shame on you. I didn't do it. Don't say shame on me. I didn't do anything. Why does he use canines? Wouldn't it be more better to use dogs? Right. Well, dogs is just a slang term for the canine. But you use mainly dogs or does he use mainly canines? In the United States, canine and dog, it's kind of an interchangeable word. All right, for real. Okay. Most of the dogs we get are black in color. We do get some yellows and rarely we get some chocolate colored ones too. Ain't that a bit racialist? getting mainly black dogs to do this. They're saying, all right, this is dangerous work, let's get the brothers in to no, go and find the bombs. That has nothing to do with that. Why does you choose dogs to decide where bombs is? Why don't you choose a more intelligent animal like a dolphin? And again, that'd be quite difficult to have a, uh, a fish tank on a cart. But I don't know if you know this, but dolphins ain't fish. Right. They, is, they is like us, they is memories. Correct, but they have to get back to a water source every now and again. When they actually find the bomb, how long does it take the dog to defuse it? The dog has nothing to do with that. The only thing that we use the dogs for, uh, what we train the dogs for, is to locate what we call a suspicious item.